Otumfo o say to two the second asante hene wakako piemu ewo Scotland ya wako di jume diebe pri. Na wadineni echre RNA World Golf Museum. Oko ho enstrashe ya oko she enye ma ewo na oko eno one penifuwa kukudam. A wamo eda RNA World Golf Museum wano wamo echuche enkomo ana wo she sedi wamo esi edi wamo ejuma. Emina miti ni eko newe eno. UTV yeni ura Kevin Baka wano a e director of golf development ewo RNA World Golf Museum yeno no atwetwe komo ama odinsem kakra etuja wo chese wo mo pese omboa na golf bo ewo Ghana etimi kosro coach sisu so omo pese omo dibiba no mo ebe coach golfers amo ewo Ghana wie no chese ama toa golf championship ebe koso ewo South Africa next year na wo hwe nimu se Ghana golfers bebre ebe timi apiemu ho it's a privilege to have the king here to visit the RNA, um, the home of golf, St Andrews. So to be able to speak to the King about golf in Ghana and the development of golf is, uh, is a privilege. We definitely want to help Ghana. We want to help all countries um, to grow and develop the sport. But yeah, it's, it's nice to have that face-to-face -face conversation with the King and with the President of the Ghana Golf Association. But one of the things that we spoke about in the meeting there was to help the coaches, the professionals. So in many countries around the world the the level of coaching is perhaps not as strong as it could be so what we will look to do and discuss in the future weeks and months to come is how can we upscale those existing coaches so that they can become better coaches and if you get better coaches then that hopefully means you can have better players more people enjoying the game more people playing the game and that's got to be good for the future of golf in Ghana. Next year we're launching an African Amateur Championship to be played in South Africa. It'll be the first time it's a male competition. The winner of that will qualify to play in the Open Championship at Troon, which is a fantastic opportunity. So that's just one example of how we're trying to help grow the game in, in Africa, but hopefully not just in the continent, but if we can start to do more work in Ghana itself then in years to come, who knows, we might have a Ghana, a player from Ghana playing in the Open Championship. Who knows, maybe even winning the Open Championship and wouldn't that be something fantastic to aim for?